Greetings to all viewers. Be so kind as to subscribe to the channel, like and express your opinion in the comment. And now to the news. Tom Hanks is back to donate two more bags of plasma after recovering from coronavirus. Tom Hanks has been donating more plasma after recovering from coronavirus. The Hollywood star, 63, and his wife Rita Wilson both tested positive for COVID-19 back in March, while Tom was filming over in Australia for a new Elvis Presley biopic. Tom had shared his diagnosis on social media with fans and kept his followers updated as he battled the virus. He and Rita have now both recovered and are back in the US, with the pair doing everything they can to helping with coronavirus research effort. Tom and Rita have donated blood to help with vaccine research, with Tom also donating his plasma, the liquid part of the blood, at the end of April, after being told he may carry coronavirus antibodies. And, continuing with his effort, Tom revealed on Wednesday that he had been back to donate yet more plasma in fact, two bags full. Taking to Instagram, Tom shared a series of snap, does, if you re a little squeamish, of him donating his fluids and added the caption, plasmatic on three. One, plasmatic. Hang. He and Rita, also 63, were the first celebrities to reveal they had tested positive for coronavirus and have since shared their experience of the infection. Speaking to Health Magazine, Rita opened up about her strange coronavirus diagnosis. She said, you always think that bad things happen to other people until it happens to you and you realize you're not immune to it. It was similar with my breast cancer diagnosis. While all this was going on, I actually said to Tom, before breast cancer, it was a thing that was sort of in the distance as something that happens to other people. And then I said, but I don't feel that way anymore. I mean, who has to say we want to get COVID-19? And then we got it. It was so strange. Rita, known for roles in Sleepless in Seattle, Dingle All The Way and TV series The Good Wife, was diagnosed with breast cancer in early 2015. She underwent a double mastectomy one month after her diagnosis and announced her full recovery later that year. Worldwide there are now more than a million cases of coronavirus, with the US recording more than a million confirmed cases. Deaths in the US have now reached over, but it has reported the country as epicenter for the virus. New York State has seen cases and deaths fall in recent weeks. 